Kanye West lost a majority of his net worth when Adidas dropped him. He's been saying crazy things about black people. George Floyd. He's been saying crazy things about Jewish people. He's doing this to himself. He is his worst enemy. He is his final battle. I think he's about done. I think he's about done. Everybody done turned his back on him. Um, a lot of people are saying that the things he's doing is intentional. I highly doubt that after him going to Skechers and them escorting him out trying to get an endorsement. That sounds like a desperate rich man. Um, Stop saying he's smart. Stop saying he's a genius. Stop saying he's a free thinker. First of all, he's not that smart. If he goes on live television all over the place, people are cutting his interviews. People are taking his videos down and saying that all the stuff he's saying about Jews, black people, white lives matter. That's another thing. You going to tell me that everything that he's done thus far is intentional. Saying white lives matter. And the white people that he so desperately needs their validation for cuts him off. Isn't that ironic? Doesn't sound like that. That doesn't sound intentional to me. Kanye West needs white validation. He's always needed white validation. For some reason, I guess it just seems like he can't do the stuff he can do by himself. He needs all these crazy rich designer white folks to do the things and partner with him and help him help him get 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 some money, I guess. Do y'all understand how silly this whole debacle is? And everybody's saying that he's a genius because of all these things and all these people dropping him off contracts and stuff. No, it doesn't make sense. As conceited as the man is. As much of a God, God complex this man is, as much as he keeps talking about and comparing himself about these monumental white men like Steve Jobs or Walt Disney, Bill G like all these guys, you know what I'm saying? As much as he talks about himself and how much money he has, why in the world would he do such a stunt to make the, the, the company that has made him the most money in the history of Kanye West? drop him that doesn't make any sense he needs these white people because obviously he don't need niggas he's been trying to pander he's been trying to pander to a demographic that doesn't care about him or niggas at all he's been trying to pander to a group that thinks he's a free thinker but they're all in the same boat you know what i'm saying Kanye West is 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 unfortunately looking like he's in a bad space and I feel sorry for him. Um, a lot of people are saying he's mentally ill. He's mentally ill. But yeah, that's cool. But what are you going to do? What are you, what, what you going to do about uh, a, a, a rich man who has a God complex? Like, what are you going to do? You can't tell him anything. He's going to do what he wants to do. And you know what happens when he does this stuff? This people drop him. He gets opportunities slammed the door slammed on him all of that stuff and you can't say that oh all the things that he's saying are happening to him right now nigga if i go to kroger's and if i yell on the loudspeaker the owner of kroger's can can can, can suck my glizzy i'm probably going to get kicked out of the store and i'm probably going to be banned from the store you know what i'm saying also, if I say the owners of Kroger's can suck my glizzy, I bet I'm going to get banned from this. And then that happens. Oh, look what happened. What am I what I'm saying is true. You know how stupid that looks. If I go to a barber shop and I clown the barber, man, you trash, bro. And I say all types of 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 uh profanities and all this other stuff he's probably going to kick me out and he's never going to serve me and then i look stupid for being for going out all over the street announcing oh he kicked me out because i said this and i said that niggas ain't gonna be like yeah you're right 
Yeah, you you, you right. Oh, you should, damn, they kicked you out of Kroger's, bro. Dog, you was right. No. The only reason why people are moving the goalposts for Kanye West because he's Kanye West. Anybody else would have hit him with the Cat Williams. Well, you shouldn't have been talking shit. That's exactly what he shouldn't have been doing. Talking all that crazy stuff about these Jewish people. Talking crazy about black people. And it's sad because, like, you know, the man is, 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 is a very, very talented man when it comes to the music. But when it comes to all this stuff that he's doing... He's uh, people are people are giving him too much leeway. Like his fans are giving him too much leeway. Trust me, I was a Kanye West fan. I love that man's music. Late registration, one of my favorites albums of all time. Graduation has a place in my heart because I actually started college when it when it dropped. You know what I'm saying? Graduation has a special place in my heart. Beautiful dark twisted fantasy is a really awesome album. Like all that all that stuff. But then like all the stuff he's talking about. <sighs> You can't talk about a community that has their stuff all... St- okay, so I, it just seems like he was... It just seems like he was hating on a community because his community doesn't necessarily have it together. Jews, I ain't gonna hold you. I've always said this, in fact... I've always said this, Jews, Asians, um, almost any, shoot, I can go to Italian, Italian, I can go, so I live in Ohio, me and my homie went up to Cleveland one day, there's a little Italy, it's just all these Italian places, just put, all, all of these guys, they, they build businesses and they keep their money in their communities, niggas don't do that, it's getting there. But in general, niggas don't do that. You don't know how many Asian rest there and Chinese restaurants are in this city. Asian buffets, Chinese buffet, Hong Kong buffet. It's to the point where these Asian folks have infiltrated black hair salons. They're making money out of us. Jews, they do the same thing. They, 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 they lend money and they build stuff, build foundations, and, and they pass that money down to themselves and they generate wealth within their communities. Asians do that. Italians do that. Even Mexicans do that. Niggas don't do that. Niggas are too busy trying to look good. And the irony is Kanye West is a contributor to that. Niggas worry about looking the freshest, trying to look uh, good for the uh, uh, for the next nigga, all that other stuff. You know what I'm saying? They buying the big the, the the Gucci and the Prada and this one and that one. Kanye West is no different. Kanye West can't say a daggone thing if you out here selling chicken nuggets for like a hundred bucks at your listening party, and you have the nerve to talk about black people ain't doing this and black people ain't doing that. You either hot or cold. You trying to help the community or you one of those stuck up rich niggas. You got to pick one. You've got to pick one. You know what I'm saying? You either for the community or you for these rich white niggas that you so desperately need in your life. You know what I'm saying? Like, people don't think. All people can talk about is how genius is this man. Like, they're wrapped around this nigga's, like, this nigga's finger. There's a lot of these teenagers, too. Like, uh, you know, you got these grown cats, you know, we see through this nigga. But, like, these, I don't know. You got a lot of impressionable people that think this man is, like, really doing something. But he's not. He's falling apart. He's falling apart. Like, you like you can read between the lines. Like, it's like, bro. How are we, like, he, 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 he does his White Lives Matter shirt. Why does White Lives Matter? Well, because they do. Oh, well, they showed you how much you matter, my guy. Let's see how that story ends. Listening to, listening to uh, 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 Candace Owens. Pandering a bunch of old white people don't even care about black people. Don't even know what a graduation or a late registration is or a college dropout is. I said that the last time, but. I'm just re, you know, he, his shit done dropped, bro. Everybody done dropped him. 
He was saying a bunch of stuff about everybody. And now he's out here looking desperate. And he's even going to Skechers just to look for just to make some shoes. Because he wants that billionaire status. Niggas thought this was intentional. No. He wants that billionaire status. He wants that back. He's $400 million in net worth now. That is a majority. 1.2? billion dollars gone down the drain because you was talking too much I'm only talking about this nigga again because I want people to realize that this man is not doing what y'all think he's doing unfortunately he's probably in a bad mental space right now he doesn't know what's going on that's another thing that I need to say I ain't trying to what how much time okay it's only 12 minutes I'm not going to say this much, but what I really want to say is he needs help. Number one, as a Christian, I'm a Christian. As a Christian, the people that have been ministering to him or the people that should be ministering to him or counseling him have failed this man. And and as Christians, y'all need to look at yourselves because y'all are letting this man go and, and, and using using. Uh, um, using the faith as some type of catalyst or a, uh, something as a part of this catalyst to do some stuff to be honest with you I always thought the Sunday service stuff was kind of weird I mean it looked good but I, I I don't know I just I just hope he wasn't that conceited to where like it, it was like almost a cult I ain't gonna get into that never mind I'm not gonna get into that but the people that should be counseling him are not counseling him, and and they're it's not looking good. It's not looking good. Kanye, get some help, bro. Get some help. I think this is the last time I'm gonna talk about this cat. Hopefully, before he says anything else, because I don't really, because like, only reason why I'm talking about this man is because I want people to realize the stuff that he's doing is not intentional. It's not intentional whatsoever. It's not smart. It's not smart at all, and he needs help, and he needs to realize what he's doing so people can counsel him. It's okay. Like, you don't always have to be the top of the line, to like, the at the top of the pole. Like, there's no competition, bro. You're Kanye West. People know who you are. You're, you're, you're a musical genius, bro. You're a great designer. You don't need to prove nothing to nobody, especially these white people that you believe in so much that are easy, that, that easily just cut you off of everything in this world. And now you got niggas that don't even want to, that ain't even studying you now because of the things you've said and the things you've done. I miss the old Kanye, bro. <laughs> I miss the old Kanye. Uh, 